right now. I thank you, Lord, for the men of God. I thank you for those men that are watching and those that are connected to each and every person that are on this stream. We pray now, God, that you would go forth and release your spirit and breathe fresh life into them. That you would breathe a fresh perspective over their minds. Even now, we employ and apply the blood of Jesus over every mind, over every emotion, over every bloodline. And today, we stand to decree and declare that the strongholds are being broken off of the men's lives, off of the father's line, that the stereotypes and every negative word that has been associated with their name and every negative word that has been generated and spoken over them, I reverse the effects of the negative words and I send it back to the pit of hell and I decree and declare you shall be who God called you to be. You are powerful. You are mighty. You are a provider. You are all that God says that you are. So today we stand in the presence of the Holy Spirit and the word says where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. So I speak liberty across the airways and I speak liberty to every man watching this live stream, to every man connected to every woman that's watching this live stream. I speak liberty to be released in your home, liberty to be released in your mind, liberty to be released in your emotions. And I call you free right now. The Bible says whom the sun sets free is free indeed. And today, on Father's Day of 2020, I decree and declare freedom is hitting your bloodline. Freedom is hitting your bloodline. And you are coming into the manhood and the responsibility and the authority that God has called you to be. I speak fresh authority over your life. I speak fresh access into your ability to do what God has called you to do. Man of God, come out of the grave. Man of God, wake up from your sleeping state. Man of God, you are valuable. You are needed. You are important. And we call you forth to your place of power, to your place of kingship. We thank you, God, because these men are your heirs in the earth realm. And they are seated in heavenly places like you are at the right hand of the Father. So we call you kings. We call you priests. We call you prophets. We call you intercessor. We call you world changer. We call you culture changer. And we decree and declare that that which comes from your loins shall live and have a legacy that changes the game. You, sir, are a game changer. You, sir, have released the seed that will change the world. And so we lift you up as we lift God up. We encourage you as we lift God up.
this right here, what I heard the Holy Ghost say, was a victory over this entire nation.